guess it's time to face the cupcakes. Are you out here, Bella? Come on, Bella. Everybody's waiting for you. There you are. I was getting worried. Worried that I chickened out? No! I know you're not afraid of anything. I mean, what's to fear? This is a great honor. Right! Wait, I can't tell if you're being serious. Well, there is one part that I'm really afraid of. What's that? I'm afraid that you won't get any food because I'm gonna beat you to the Maiden's Feast. Dream on! Hello? Shh! Surprise! Surprise! Whoa. Yay! There is my Valoria. Oh, look at my pretty girl. I can't believe. I just can't believe. We're very proud of you. I think that's what your mother is trying to say. Oh, she's not even dressed yet? Can we do that after cake? Come on, cake first! All right, but come on. Let's get this good time over with. Oh, yes, cake. Now, where did I put that knife? Nobody touches that cake until I find the ceremonial knife. <sighs> you seem excited. I am! I think I'm gonna barf. That could be all the cupcakes you've been eating. I'm just sad I'm too young. I wish we didn't have to wait 14 years for another Mog. I'll try to make you proud, Rocky. I'm already proud of you, stupid. You sure this Maiden's Feast is a good idea, Pops? I... It's what you want, right? I guess so. I mean, you hear about it all your life. I'm just starting to wonder. Don't worry, sweetheart. You'll do great. Maybe the knife is under this towel. <laughs> Never gonna find it. Dad, I hope you're not hiding that knife for your own good. <laughs> Don't touch the red ones. Mom made those just for me. You're going to eat all of those? I've already had six. Mom, I was just wondering, what if we fought the monster instead of feeding it? That's my girl. Now that's beast ender blood talking. Please, my loves, don't make this any harder than it already is. Lavina? What is it, girl? My grandpa doesn't look too happy about this feast. Your grandpa is just stuck in the ways of old. Your grandma was the same way. Bless her soul. Not all of the town elders have stayed as hip and with it as I have. How many of these feasts have you organized? Let's see. A new Grand Mog appears every 14 years, and I'd have seen six of them, so... Hey! Are you trying to get my age out of me? I'll never tell. What is Mog Chathra? The latest in a long, distinguished line of Grand Mogs to visit our land. Distinguished? Well, anything that lives that long becomes distinguished. I mean, look at me! <laughs> Why was I chosen? In every town visited by a Grand Mog, the villagers vote for the maidens who represent their town's best qualities. So in other words, beats me. Grandpa Beastender? <laughs> do you know where Mom's knife is? <laughs> Wouldn't tell you if I did. I'm not doing one thing to help with this shame feast. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this Maiden's Feast either, to tell you the truth. Then fight it, girl! Stand up for yourself! I hope you're not filling that girl's head with nonsense, Brahma. For me? Split it with you? Deal. On second thought, you can have the whole thing. Suit yourself. Now, where did I put that thing? What thing? Nothing. Uh, I didn't say anything. All right, time to serve this girl up. But first, can I ask just one more time? Honey. Why don't we just kill Mog Chothra? <laughs> <laughs> here, here! <laughs> oh, honey. Oh, we're going to miss your sense of humor. Majestic to behold. Oh, inspiring. Powerful. Mysterious. But Mog Chothra is more than that. Merciful and generous. Mog Chopra keeps our town safe. All he asks is may he pick some of our flowers passes through. Please come, Mog Chopra, and make your selections. Welcome to the Maiden's Feast. Show him what you're made of, Bella. I know he'll pick you. This can't be right. Hey. What do you say we break out of here? Trying to get us all to quit so you'll win the feast, huh? 
Well, it's not gonna work on me. I'm in it to win it, baby. You're making me hungry. I'm trying to make Mog Chathra hungry. These girls have it all backwards. Think it's attractive to starve themselves. Wanna trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? Need a towel? Nope. They taught us to eat daintily in finishing school. I'm warning you, buzzard! I will fuck you alive if you come near my food again! Hey, does that costume have any thorns we can use as weapons? It does, but they're made out of chocolate. Regardless, I accept my noble burden, not with apprehension, but with joy. I give my life so that no harm comes to our village. No! I give my life! No, me! Hey, I've got a plan. I already have a plan, thanks. Attract Mog Chopra with my slender frame and be remembered forever as a hero. Well, good luck. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. When the monster gets close, you can use your candles to burn its eyes. Don't distract me. I think I've got a chance to win this. <laughs> Get out of here. Are you kidding? I've been starving myself for weeks for this. Hey, can I have a drink of that water? Hmm. Trade you for that sweet corset you've got on. You never can be too thin. This horrible thing? You got a deal. Ooh, what a relief. I feel so much. Oh, I'm sorry. But this thing's just too big for me. Trade back. Oh, that poor girl. Oh, no! That should have been me! Can I borrow that bottle one more time? Keep it. Thanks. I don't need it where I'm going. How about something bubbly to wash it down? Oh, thanks. Don't mind if I... I've got a towel here if you throw me that drumstick. You have a towel? Why didn't you say so? Oh, <laughs> how long have you been standing there? Are you part vulture or something? How can you think about food at a time like this? Chakra's fury will soon rain down upon our village! 